Hey YouTube, it's Aqua, and I'm here to show you how to basically use Asus, my Asus Glide X, uh, I think it's Screen X, oh, Screen Expert, and a bunch of other applications to basically do the same things that you can do in your Samsung applications, such as multi-control, um, you know, being able to use your mouse within uh, all devices, your tablet to your phone, to your computer, and vice versa. Um, this is all free too. So let's dive in. So first things first, you're going to have to download a program called My Asus. And this program, uh, I'm going to put the link in the description, but this program can be installed by any, uh, any, any um, Windows computer here. So for instance, let's do um, Microsoft Store here. And we're gonna type in my Asus, and the my Asus app comes up here. So I'm gonna drop that link in the description for y'all. And once you install that, you'll have this application here. You're gonna to want to go to Asus Apps and Deals on the left side. I would definitely say make an account if you want to. It's up to you. It's probably best actually no make an account, then uh, go to Asus Apps and Deals. And then you're gonna be able to download Glide X. Now, if Glide X does not show up on, um, if it doesn't show up also on there, then you can just search up Glide X also on the Microsoft Store, and it will also be here as well. And like I said, this is free for everyone. So this is the major bag alert, major key alert. See, easy multitasking, screen extend, screen mirroring. Okay. So once you install that, all applicate all your ASUS applications should be listed here in your library. You're gonna click on Glide X. Glide X is gonna load up. You're gonna to wanna to log in to the Glide X application. So once you log into that, you're gonna hit start now, okay? And then you're gonna have all the things you can do here. So you can mirror, you can extend, you can unify, which is pretty dope. You can file transfer, uh, you can join phone functions like uh, te telecommunications, like making phone calls and all that stuff. Shared cam, so if you see the webcam going on, you can see it from your computer. Remote access, so you can remotely uh, log into your phone at any point in time. Uh, and then you can stream on here as well, if anyone's looking into that. All right, so with all that being said, we also have to download the uh, Asus app on your phone, quote unquote, the Glide X app. So you're gonna wanna go to uh, the app store on your phone here. And I actually have the Glide X app on my phone. So I'm going to open up on Windows Phone Link here, and we're gonna just be able to open both up. So I have it here on my Glide. Just move it over here. All right, as you can already see, I am logged in on the phone app here. So now um, all you need is the phone app, and then whatever you say on here, it's gonna go to the phone. Okay, so we're gonna start now. And we're going to do uh, we're gonna do mirror. So and like I said, this is pretty pretty elite. So just found it immediately. You can remember as your current device. And remember, this is free. I promise you, no bread at all. And it doesn't matter which device you're on. So now that we did that, it may be requesting me. Okay. So uh, by the way, so you can either use Wi-Fi or USB for this. Okay. So it's probably it may be a better connection using the um using the actual um using what using the usb because it doesn't take up that much um stuff there oh wait so let me just do this here and okay so die with me here while we troubleshoot so there's there's multiple ways to this okay you can either go to the glide x app right get the qr code and scan it there okay we can do it multiple ways here so we can either go to here and then remember, and then from here, show again automatically. Do not show this again, yes. All right, now it's gonna connect again. We're going to accept. Now it's gonna ask you to accept. And what I had to do is I had to close it, and now I just have to allow it to screen record. And this is gonna be a faster process next time. So as you can see now, we have it up, we have it open here, and please reset it a little bit, it's already turned on, okay. So we can cancel this, so it's going to show everything. So yes, uh, pair your desktop with your PC. Okay, so that's another thing you can do. You can pair your, your phone to your actual computer here. Hold on one second. Okay, so once again, it is 
it is on it. So now we're on mouse mode right now. So I have a mouse controlling. Let's see. Do not show again. Hit escape to exit mirror mode. Okay, do not show again. Exit. All right, so now we can click here. The mouse mode is still there. Let's hit home. The home key, go to settings. All right, so it looks like we have to enable it in the settings here um, in order for us to uh, do it here. Um, so let's go to Glide X, make sure that is on. It was on, but we'll turn it off and turn it on again. Droid, 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 you know what I'm saying? That's just what it is. All right, so once you enable it into the accessibility settings here, um, I think that should be good. All right, so let's go back home. All right, so once you're on here, everything should be good. Now it's showing and we have everything uh, showing on the phone here. We can hit escape. And yeah, I mean, there's a lot of different functionality things you can do with this. Once again, you extender, you can unify, control, all for the free transfer files. Um, and there's much more applications you can use for this. Uh, if there's any other questions or any concerns, let me know in the comment section. Please leave a like and comment. And uh, let's get it. Let's go. I'll see you on the next video. All right. Peace.